My name is Colin George, Swiss Fibre Installation Engineer, and I'm going to be talking you through a Toby Pot installation. So today is a Toby Pot job, and this is the Toby Pot for the property. Toby Pot installation procedure requires us to dig your, your grounds, whether it be grass, uh, gravel. We would remove the gravel out of the way, make a channel at low level and lay the microduct. If it's concrete, we would channel out with an angle grinder, break it out with a breaker, and then make good with the concrete by replacing it with fresh concrete. Okay, so now we're at the stage of the job where it's time to blow the fiber down to the chamber. So now I'm gonna start setting up the gun and compressor so I can blow the fiber to Colin and Femme at the chamber. Give the ignition a tuck. We work in a two-man team. The second person would be at the node. Once he receives the fiber, he would dress it by putting the head on, check the light levels connected to the node, call the first person at the house, make sure he's receiving the correct light levels. Once we know that the correct light levels are being received, he would dress the Omni box. When I say dress, wrap the cable around in the Omni, connect them together, check the light levels inside the house. Once we see that the light levels are good, we can then go ahead and start the activation process on the ONT. Hi, I'm Nick Dennis. I'm the head of installations at Swish Fiber. I'm going to talk to you about the inside of an installation expert. After we've drilled from the inside to outside of your house, uh, to bring the fiber in from the termination outside into the ONT. This is one of Swish Fiber's ONTs. Uh, this will be mounted on the inside of your house somewhere near the uh, drill out. This ONT is future proofed and is capable of a 10 gig connection. After we connected up the ONT to the fibre, the signal then comes out to one of our plume pods, which is essentially a router. We can mesh as many plume pods as we need to to get the strongest signal around your house. So each plume pod will then talk to the next plume pod to the next plume pod to give you the best possible signal in the house. So now you know what to expect from a Swish Fibre installation. If you have any further questions around the install, please don't hesitate to contact us at the customer care line.